Hello and welcome back to EU Sustainable Energy Week. I'm joined now by one of the other winners in the communications category, uh, and uh, uh, Gordon you're, uh, from Superhomes. Just tell us a little bit about the project and what you were setting out to achieve. Okay, Superhomes is a network now of 180 homeowners. They've all done fantastic things to improve the energy efficiency of their homes. So these are some of the UK's uh, homes most improved for en energy use. Um, we and they're, they're retrofit homes, are they? They're, are they all retrofit? These, or are, they these are all older homes that have been uh, renovated uh, to reduce carbon by 60%. So 60% carbon saving makes them a super home. And then we encourage them to open twice a year to the public to share their experience, share their stories, uh, talk about the uh, benefits and the challenges involved in doing that work. And this is one of the things which uh, you know we, we've all, uh, always argued that there's a lot of um, technology and standards about new builds, things like passive houses and, uh, and things like that. But the big issue is that 80% of our uh, it, or even more than that, by if some estimates, it, it is already built and you know, and is due to last till 2050. How do we uh, create energy efficiency within that environment? So, uh, what are some of the stories that uh, that you found about some of the benefits that people have felt by doing this? Well, you, you're right about the issue. Um, in the UK, we've uh, 26 million homes. Um, about uh, and they're responsible for 27 percent of carbon emissions about a third of them are old inefficient um, homes that are cold in winter so the the sort of benefits that people find from retrofit very much um, figure around comfort uh, we're off, I, they're able to achieve five star comfort and also all, all these super homes have a uh, an interest in the in, impact on the environment and saving the environment so uh, for them that's another big plus of, of what they're doing. So, so we were talking a little bit off air as well and you were pointing to the fact that some of the DNA of the individuals who have already done this uh, is uh, people who are uh, uh, part of the uh, uh, you know already part of the association part of the part of the uh, um, you know part of the uh, whole uh, 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 ecosystem, so they may be architects or, or something like that. Now, how, how do we get individuals who aren't in the business starting to embrace that? That to me seems like a, a big challenge. Mm. It's, it's true that uh, a minority of the superhamers are already in the business, um, but the, we also have a, a vast range of um, home, private homeowners who may have invested from. Uh, 10,000 uh, pounds upwards really in, in the work. Some of them have e even uh, DIY'd the work. So we're representing quite a, a range of uh, levels of income and you know professional and just personal interest in, in and, and so, so tell me just because we're coming out the uh, to the end of the time of the sort of short interviews where we've got allocated for um, what, what are so, uh, some of the benefits of having the, the super home awards you know what, what are people uh, you know other than getting an award which always makes people sound good but uh, but what are some of the other things that uh, why people are coming to you and say we, we'd like to go through this acc accreditation we'd like to be a super home Okay, well, Superhomes um, has become its own brand, really. So it, we're, we're finding that it's starting to attract uh, people who, who want some recognition, really, for, for their achievement. And it is a huge achievement, a very tough um, a level to, to reach the 60% carbon saving through renovation. So really uh, looking... Yeah, we're attracting high achievers. Right, okay. Yeah. People who do just want to get out there and, and, and do would it. like the re some recognition yeah. for it. And also to share, to share what they've learned because it's, it can be a huge learning process for people, often over many years. Uh, so they gain a lot of experience, um, a lot of insight into what works well, what works le le work less well perhaps for And them, then I would so. imagine your hub then allows, let's say, people like me to look at it and go, right, okay, well... Here are the mistakes everybody's already made. I'm not going to make those again. Oh. Co correct. The, uh, the website, superhomes.org.uk, is about sharing information. So it's an opportunity to contact uh, superhomers directly about particular technologies they might have employed or particular approaches. 
know, whether that be DIY or bringing in a professional uh, team to, to deliver the work. So uh, we try and make it um, the exchange as rich as possible. Excellent. Gordon, well, uh, I'm afraid that's all we've got time for. Thank you for sharing your pro project. Thank you. Thank you as well for watching. As I said, we've been covering EU Sustainable Energy Week uh, for the last two days. Lots of interviews on the website as well, plus um, the uh, uh, Angerati content all around energy and the dynamics of the energy market. So thank you for watching.